gentlemen, uh, let's get ready to rumble! All right! Check, check, can you hear me? We are live. Good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Can you hear me? Yes? Yo, yo, yo. Check one. Hi. We early today? Yes. Absolutely, we're early. Can you hear me? Loud and clear? Okay. Just wanted to make sure because we played with some settings yesterday. Um, why early today? Oh, JD Sports. Just the JD Sports um, finish line shit. It's only 10 minutes early. Is it really that big of a deal? If anybody wants the sulfurs, they're dropping it. They're dropping here. That's it. Um, that's it for today. So great. Thanks for coming through. Have a nice day. Uh, let me move my chat box. I like my chat box. Yeah, there we go. Wild early jumpstart algorithm boost. Algorithm boost. It's early because of JD. Yeah. But like, I don't, does anybody even want these vivid sulfurs? I feel like, honestly, this is like another, I think these fours, I think the only people that want these are resellers. Uh, like, legit, dude. I think the only people that want these are resellers. Let me fix my camera and shit. Hold on. The fuck? I legit think that only people that want these are like the resellers. Um, early bird gets the worm. Yeah. Uh, we'll see. I do. I do. I'm small foot gang. Okay. Um, they should be pretty, pretty easy. Uh, I'm small foot gang. I'm going to cop. Okay. That's a $300 shoe. They're below retail in some sizes already. Maybe if you can cop the big sizes, I guess. Um, can't even wear a 12. Yeah. Missed the stream last night. I was watching the shorthanded Knicks. Missing two starters. Barely lost to the Heat. Yeah. They lost to the Heat. They did. Uh, milk in the canary color. Milk in it? It's not really a, a canary, dude. It's like a... It's not even yellow. It's a sulfur. It's like a sulfur. It's not a yellow. It's like a mustard. It's like a... It's like a honey... It's not a honey mustard. It's like a... It's a weird mustard color. It's not like yellow, yellow. The pictures make it look yellow, dude. When they showed it on the um the sneakers live, it looked like a yeah, it looked like a mustard. Yeah. So yeah, it's not like uh, the off whites. It's yellow. It's not. A, trust me, it's like a weird yellow, bro. It's a weird yellow. I'm telling you right now, it's a weird yellow. I mean, obviously pictures, you can't even look at the pictures because pictures are like freaking satur saturation and people edit the shit out of them. Um, this sneaker has a big problem. I'm Seth. This is the Air Jordan 4 Vivid. Of course, so it's like in 1080p. Why is this? Yes, this sneaker is a... No. It's just a junk content of mine. This sneaker is a... It's a Big Bird Yellow? Yes, sir. Nah. Is it? This sneaker... It's fucking... This, this content is gar... Like... 
no offense, like this fucking. These look fake. Are these fake? Yeah, these are fakes. I was like, what the hell? Those are hella fakes. That's fake as shit. Full review. Yeah, look at that shit. That shit, hella fake. God, I can't even find a decent video that's like not like. Never mind. Dude, I, uh, this is like. Look at this shit. Everyone's the same fucking content. It's the same fucking shit. Boom, boom, boom. Same old shit. Same shit. I just want to see the shoe. I don't want... Is this fakes too? Are these fakes too? It's like in fucking 1080... It's not, not even... It's like in 520p. 540p. What the hell is this shit, dude? Don't upload it if it's not in 1080 or 4K. Don't even upload it. You're wasting everyone's time. Uh... Camera from 2013 recorded it from microwave. Got to start somewhere. I mean, with today's day and age, with a phone, phone use your phone. Phone has better quality. Cues up. All right. Uh. Cues up for the brick fours. Yeah, I mean, this is a reseller shoe. This is for the resellers, honestly. This is a reseller's. Uh, what about Alex? What's going on? I don't know. Someone's just saying what kind of yellow it is. I don't know. I thought it was like a mustard yellow. I thought it was like a mustard yellow. It is what it is. If you think it's it's big bird yellow, it's big bird yellow. Um, it's nice for the ladies, I guess. I don't know. Like, are the ladies buying them up? How many ladies are interested in them? A lot. It's yellow like Travis Scott. No, I, it's a different yellow. Travis is more like bright, bright yellow. This one's, a, I think it's sulfur, bro. Sulfur is like... It's a different type of yellow. It's a different shade. Yeah. Baby diarrhea yellow. I mean, if you want them, get them. Obviously, I mean, the only four I really want is militaries, and I'm good on everything. Or whatever, industrial, right? Other than that, man, y'all can have all these fours. I don't need... I'm good with fours. Sulfur yellow is like a saturated bright that brings spaces to life with its yellow-green intensity. Yeah, it's like a yellow-green, isn't it? I thought what I thought when I saw with the... um. It's like a yellowish-green. But... Uh, it's yellow f with a drop of barbecue sauce in it. Uh, I'm good on industrial too. Yeah. Why? Because everyone else is going to have them. Yeah. Sulfur smells like absolute ass. Weird name of choice. Sulfur? Yeah. It's like a mineral, isn't it? The color blocking is fire. Yeah. Well, it's the same thing they just did with the, uh, what, the sea foams, right? 
It's the same thing as the sea foams. Uh, sea foams are better. Sea foams are better. Sea foams are, I'd say sea foams are better. My personal opinion, I'd take the sea foams. Top of the world at Kicks for Days, what up? 1.2 million pairs, people about to chill on those two. We'll see. I think people will go overboard. Uh, I think people will go overboard. People are going to scoop up like five or six pairs. Seafoam is more subtle. Yeah. I mean, I think seafoam is more, uh, I don't know, more wearable, like you said. Uh, morning, Ross. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to see last night's live with M. Catching up on it now. Love how you thought M was a hot bot. Hot bot, yeah. Hey, you never know with the internet. You just never know with the internet, man. I like the Nike on the back. Pass on these. Yeah, they're not gonna put Nike on the back on these, bro. It's disrespecting the Nike Air. You're disrespecting Nike Air by put if you put it on these shoes. Some like you know what I mean. Like you just, it's not necessary. Rodian, Jesus, that real difficult. Damn, nobody's going for these. I must not have status. There's no way. Not all fours deserve Nike Air. Yeah, I agree. 100% agree. It's been hailing and snowing in the days, what, straight here? Uh oh, the weather is bad. Yeah, here we go. EA. Easy. They just keep feeding me EA, bro. They literally keep feeding me EA. Uh, um. Easy pass. Easy. No big sizes. No, they had big sizes. They had a 10. They had a men's size 10, I think. I no, they didn't didn't have any I don't think they had big sizes. No big sizes. Ross, you copping for M? No. M doesn't wear four. M doesn't M doesn't even wear her sea foams. <laughs> M doesn't even wear her sea foams. M doesn't even wear her sea foams. <laughs> Michigan weather is Malky status. Uh oh. M's a New Balance. A M New Balance A6. Tell her to say to me. You guys the same size? Thank you. Girls all about New Balance and A6 these days. One thousand percent. One thousand percent. Girls, uh, girls are all about the A6 and the New Balance. Not all of them, but most. There's like a. I mean, it's a huge wave. Thoughts on Travis being more important than MJ? I said yes, and people. Uh, I still get people are DMing me like all mad. Uh, without 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 MJ, there is no shoe. That's not the whole point. 
people I think that whole debate went over everyone's head. That whole debate went over everyone's head. Like it was about the whole point was now in the now like today. Who is more important for the for as far as like influential? That's what it was about. And I don't understand. I I mean, I don't get it. MJ yeah, MJ's not even in the, MJ is in the background. He's not even in it anymore. So I don't even know how you can say he's so influential. He's not even a part of it. He's in fucking the Bahamas smoking a cigar, fishing, gambling his money away. Like I still I don't get it. I'm just saying, like, that's the whole point. Like, who's more influential? Are they using MJ for commercials? Are they using MJ to push shoes? No. Like, he's not involved anymore. Yeah. So it's like... It's not, I don't, I don't think, I don't think like, yeah, I think people ran with it. It's like, oh yeah, well, there's no shoe. There's no shoe. There's no like, yeah, no shit. But that's not the point. I think it went over. He was influential when he was playing. 1,000%. 1,000%, Mikey. 1,000%. Yeah. But like, it's like time goes on. Like, again, it's like anything else with sports. You know, like Tom Brady, for instance, right? Tom Brady is the GOAT. But at some point, you know, like 10 years late, 10 years down the road, I'm going to be like, oh my God, Tom Brady's the GOAT. And then there's going to be some, like, whatever, Jen, whatever they're on. He's going to be, no, Patrick Mahomes is the greatest court QB ever, right? Or some QB is this, this QB is the greatest. He's the GOAT. It's like, no, Tom Brady is. But, like, it's all different times. You had to watch it. You had to see it. Uh, I like the fours when they don't have the suede toe box. Yeah. MJ's on his yacht, unbothered as F. Oh, yeah. Bro, he's on, the, he's off, he's on his boat fishing for marlins or something. <laughs> Didn't someone say he always goes... Uh, does, doesn't he say like, didn't someone say he always does this like Marlin, uh, ch fishing tournament? He's always there. Okay. If Jordan, if Jordan don't like it, then it won't see any light. So no matter what you say about how impactful TS is, remember, Jordan is the one who allows him to cook. The hell does that mean? What does that even mean, allows him to cook? So you're saying because he approves it, it he, is the, he is the most influential because he gets it, he's probably sitting, smoking a cigar on his boat, gets an email, hey, can you approve these shoes? Yep. What does that even mean? Again, you it's like you guys just feeling salty because at the end of the day, like, bro, it's I, I get it. I totally understand. It's like watching yourself, watching what you truly love become like, you know, a thing of the past. I get it. It's tough. It's a tough pill to swallow, right? It's a tough pill to swallow. You're watching your favorite shit become uh, a thing of the past. But you know what? It's you. I mean, it's still part of history. Jordan Brand is going to continue after MJ passes. Of course, that the brand goes on forever. Got to compare reimagined sales and Jumpman Jack sales. I mean. That's tough because they're not on the same level. They're not on the same level. That's kind of tough. They would never do a million pairs of TSs. Could they? 
One thousand percent. If they did a million pairs of TSs, people would buy them up. I'm not salt. I'm happy he's taken over. But my issue is people think he just bum rushed himself to the spot he's in right now. When Jordan was the one who allowed the collar to flourish. Oh my! Nobody, the collab to flourish. That's not the point, though. You just diverted it. You trying to like? You're trying to like? You just diverted the whole thing. That's no point. Like again. You're bringing up something that wasn't even in part of the debate. Like, yeah, Jordan shoes exist, and he's using the platform f to grow his brand. You're hundred percent. But the thing is, MJ is not the face of his brand anymore. That's all. Th that's that's besides the point. Like, yes, at the end of the day, the base of it is a Jordan shoe. So you're right, yeah, the canvas that it's being used on is a Jordan shoe. But I think he's not the face anymore. And I don't think there's nothing any I don't think there's anything wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that at all. There's absolutely nothing wrong with that of him not being the face. Because there will still be regular Jordan shoes, right? No collabs, just regular GRs. Um, Luka Doncic is crazy on the court, just needs another person out there with him. Just needs another person out there. He's got Kyrie, buddy. What do you want? He just needs another person? This man, this man just d diminished Kyrie. Ross, Travis dropped 60K sneakers a year. You got to reel the hook back in. He drops way more than 60K, buddy. Huh? He drops way more than 60K. He's a, I mean, the rumor is he's about to drop 72,000 Jumpman Jacks. He's about to drop 72,000. And them shits are going to eat... Them shits... Bro, the Jumpman Jacks are going to be... Are like... You take some... I think Crew said it. Take that shoe away for this month. What Jordan shoe you copping this month? Most of you guys are not copping anything. Or not going for anything. But, like, that's besides the point. So, exclusive access, anybody cop this? Anybody get these? I mean, that's kind of, I mean, military blues in one month. Yeah, at the end of next month, unfortunately, though. Still a long way to go for military blues. He averages 60K a year. Um, I think it's honestly, dude, it's like 60K a drop, Jose. If I, be on, I mean, it doesn't seem like it. I agree, right? You might think it's so limited because nobody hits. But, bro, I'm telling you, it's like 60 to 80K a pair, at least. You have to, re yeah, but I think you guys forget there's like, he's broken the record twice for the amount of entries on the sneakers app. I think, what was it, 2.5 million entries? 2.5 million entries. So yeah, even though 60K, but you got 2.5 million entries. But anyways. Bought entries. It's still entries. It's still entries, my man. Bought, thought, whatever you want. They're all entries. You know? That's one for how many? I know. So it's like, it's tough. That's why a lot of people don't hit. 
and you might seem like it's very, 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 very limited, but it's not. It's still not humans. It's still a lot, dude. Again, you're trying to diminish it. It's still a lot. But again, uh, fun episode last night. I appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Uh, I'm just pointing out the obvious. I know, but like, it don't matter if it's bots or whatever, it's still like, again, nobody's going above and beyond, right? I mean, think about it. Are you, I, I mean, when the, when, okay, say when the Jumpman Jacks drop, for instance, I mean, it's the same thing with Kobe's too. Like, you guys are going to enter in multiple times. Like, where I'm going to go three phones, four phones, have everybody I know enter. So, I, I don't think it's half bots. It's, it's probably a good, it's probably a decent amount that are bots. But anyways, so exclusive access. Did anybody even get him? Let me see. Show you W's. Nobody. Not one person wanted them. Not one person wants them. Not one person. We got more dubs on the burritos. Bro, not one person wants the fours. Not one person in here cop the fours. It goes to show you the fours have fallen, bro. Not one person copped the fours. Stock on sulfur fours is 230,000 pairs. Holy shit. 230,000 pairs. They, I mean, a reseller is going to buy them up like that. Until the military f blues fours drop next month, yeah. I'm waiting on military blues. Puke yellow is not a color I want to wear. I feel like, bro, like two, I don't think people realize this as well. You talk about the sneaker game, how for men has dropped. Dude, the women market has probably dropped even more, you know? <laughs> Like, the women market for shoes was small to begin with. You know? Like, it's just, it wasn't, the women's sneaker market, it was small. It was a small market, and they pushed it so much for how many exclusive shoes. And it was mostly men that bought them. It was mostly men that bought up the women's shoes. Now I can imagine, like, the women's market's probably even more, like, w like worse than men. Way worse than men. So, uh, are they really double, double the stock of the, for the blues? Um... Yeah, they are really double the the yeah the industry blues are, are gonna be stacked. There's gonna be so many pairs. Uh, 
uh, only for Nike and Jordans. Others are doing extremely well for men and women. Well, the price point, I think, again, the price point pays out, plays a huge factor. You know, I think price point matters. $210 for some J's. When you can get some ASICs for 160, 130. Or oh, what's that what's that ASICs that we saw? The the eleven thirties for ninety five bucks. Tell me, tell me you can you find a hot shoe right now for ninety five bucks? Maybe Samba's. Samba's a little bit more money. But that what if it that that A6 eleven thirty for ninety five bucks is crazy. Crazy. That shoe looks dope and it's cheap. So, yeah, I think Jordans are just overpriced. I think Jordans are overpriced. Enjoyed the show last night with M. Ross, thank you. No, thank you for tuning in. If you missed it, if you guys missed it, go show some love. The the show last night, if when you have chance. Uh, that will be every Tuesday. So, we'll run it back next Tuesday. Um, Man, we'll just we'll just work on it. We'll try to evolve it, structure it. And uh so many people have hit me up trying to come on. Like <laughs> I got people like like Ross, get me on. Ross, get me on. I don't want it to be like a super, super male dominant show in a way. Right? Like I just don't want it to be a super male dominant show. Um, so we'll see how it is. Cause then if you have it super, I want, it's gotta be 50, 50. I, it's gotta be a 50, 50 show. M didn't want the show to end. I know she would have kept going. But she didn't eat. I, I had to stop her. She didn't break her fast. I was like, you got to chill. Like, you got to go eat and drink some water. Oh, Dog TV 2, show was fire us. I like it. The vibe was nice. W, appreciate it. I don't know. We could be the new fresh and fit. <laughs> I mean, it's got to start somewhere. It's got to be the, it might, it might be the new fresh and fit. Jays are super overpriced. If not a hype Jordan collab or a hype Jordan, they will sit and go on sale. Then people will slowly buy them up on sale. Facts. 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 I agree with that. Ross, I really do think you're on to something when with the he said, she said live. I think so too, man. I honestly, I to be honest... I, it did better than I thought, and it was a lot, it was a lot more engaging than I thought. You know, like I always look at the chat rate. The chat rate is something I, you know, that is in very very important for statistics for streams. Is the chat rate, and dude, the chat rate was fantastic. The viewer duration was kind of iffy. You know, I think average view duration was like ten minutes or so, which is you know. It's not bad. I mean, we did have a huge, huge hiccup in the beginning where we like kind of like f screwed up the settings. We did have some technical issues. But once we got that figured out, like, I'll build it out. I'll give it more structure. I'll make it more look presentable. You know, I'll put more of like, I'll make it look better because instead of look like a freaking Zoom call, I'll, I'll fix it. It was just a test run. Yeah, the brother Mike's button. I'll get all. I'll get that shit all dialed in. I'll get that all dialed in. You got like. Th I mean, this is how it works, though, man. You got to start somewhere, right? You got to start somewhere, and then you build it out. You just keep building, but you got to start somewhere. You just you just gotta say fuck it and do it, you know. And whatever mistakes happen, whatever you do, you just adjust, you adapt, and you just kind of correct it. 
that's how you that's how you do it in anything anything in life you just got to do it and do you think anyone's going to remember that shit no no one's going to remember that shit I pitched to you the Roscoe show years ago. Ronald, well, I'm going to make sure I give you a fat check and a kiss if it hits. But yeah, I've had a lot of people um, already requesting to come on. Um, I don't really want it to be off the rails, though, because I feel like it's going to get hot. It's going to get steamy, right? I feel like there will be some heavy, heavy debates and people are going to yell at each other. I feel like that's a possibility. Like with me and M, me and M is very mellow. She's very subtle. She's very nice. She's a sweetheart. M is a sweetheart. She's the nicest person you'll ever meet. If you ever come up and talk to her, she would be like undivided attention, like, oh my God. And she you'll see like just the nicest, nicest person you'll ever meet. Um so I really don't want to turn into like some sort some sort of testosterone screaming match. So, oh my God, dude, you're still alive? You're still alive? You're still, you still exist? Is that Treshawn? How are you, what? Did you come back from the dead? Is that the Treshawn? And you're still watching for all these years? Bro, that's um, if anybody knows, that's my number one hater. That's my number one hater. He's still asking for an apology. <laughs> Bro, he was uh, he was gone for so long. I want an apology, bro. <laughs> Bro, I'll be on my deathbed and you still ain't going to get that apology. I thought it was lotion. I don't know. I, lotion fell off. Lotion, lotion realized that he's got to do something with his life. I'm back from the dead too. I think, I think what happened... Who, I think it was something, I forget, was it RJ Kicks or something? Where are you, bro? He's like, he got banned. So I had to go back into my ban list and like take everyone off because I had to find this guy. So a lot of people got unbanned. So there's a lot of people that are back. But it's crazy that you guys still watch, but you guys were just banned this whole time and you still watched. I appreciate that. You guys are uh, dope. Uh, today, later today, just an FYI, we got crew coming on. Um, we're jumping on the we're jumping on the sticks, uh, and uh, we got crew coming on later. We're gonna do some Madden. I'm gonna bust his ass real quick live. Um, so that's the plan later on. I didn't watch. Oh yes, you did. Yes, you did, Treshawn. You still watched. You still watched. You still wrote me those letters. I got all your letters, bro. Uh, a Madden wager? I think so. If he wants to do it, we could do a Madden wager. Um, we also can get some people on too later if we want to play some 2K or whatever. Um, maybe that next week we can get some people on if anybody wants to play. Uh, any Madden, anything. What's the matter, Trajan? Shows how much people love your lives even when they get banned. Bro, it just go. How's it go? How's it go, Treshawn? Treshawn, can you sing it with me? My tea's gone cold, I'm wondering why. 
got out of bed at all. The morning rain clouds out my window, and I can't see at all. And even if I could, it all be gray. With the picture on my wall, it reminds me that it's not so bad. It's not so bad. I wrote you, but you still ain't calling. <laughs> Say it, Trey Sean. You could have signed my autograph for Matthew. It's my little brother, bro. When you want to play like second stream, like two to one, are you gonna or you want to just plug your peak hours so the restaurant can get cooked? I mean, it's up to you. Whenever you want. I mean, it's pretty much chill. I mean, I'm just gonna switch it over. Dear Ross, I wrote you, but you still ain't calling. I left my cell, my pager, and my home phone at the bottom. Dude said he'll cook you with Madden, with KC or SF. Yeah, that's a two. Yeah, that is, uh, bro. If you use, you, you can't play with KC or SF. I don't. I, I'm not letting you know my team. I'm not letting you know my team. Are we hey, are we going hometown? I mean, we could go hometown, Chicago versus New England. We could go hometown today if we want. Rep your rep your rep your hood. Rep your hood. Rep your hood. I will cook you with the Giants. All right, fine, let's go. Bay Area. Uh, Drake knocked his shoes sold out last night. People were willing to spend 200 I doubt there was that many pairs. There probably wasn't that much. I doubt there was a lot. There couldn't been. Where's all my fucking browsers and shit? Cue the song up. I got the Eagles. Ross, I was Trevor Lawrence in the chat yesterday. And the day before. Oh, you got a fake account? Man, you have a you just exposed yourself. You, so you have a you created a fake account to come in the chat. Beat him with Jacksonville? Oh, that'd be too easy. Crew, you lost to the Giants. Oh, crew, crew, see? What I heard crew got smacked by some rando yesterday. Some little Timmy rando. Honestly. Uh, but I won with the Giants. What do you mean? You got smacked by some little kid? What a... I didn't get smacked. Oh, it was a fair L, though. It was a fair L? Oh, okay. All right. All right. Well, we'll see. We'll see how it goes today, then. That's why we love sports. On any given day, anything can happen, even with video games. Fair, yeah, hundred percent. A fair L. <laughs> What's your thoughts on the Drake shoes? Uh, I tried to buy them, bro, and then someone stole them, bro. UPS stole them, so I, I actually bought them. I actually bought them. Oh. Uh. But, I mean, I tried to get to take a look at them. I was interested in them. But, Ross, on defense, what position do you play on Madden? You're into Germans, how sweaty you are. Uh, it's either, well, you play linebacker or you play corner. I mean, some people play, play D-line. But D-line, I guess. But you got to play LB. LB, middle linebacker. The Mike. You play the Mike or the Will. When does the Travis stuff drop online? Tomorrow, probably like at 10 a.m. We'll be live. He's doing a, uh, he's going to Texas. You see that? He's actually going, he's actually going to be at some colleges. You 
Now you play linebacker or safety. Safety is a good one. Yeah, safety, you read the field, see everything. You can go side to side. Uh, let me see. What is it? He's going to Texas. Um, I don't know if they posted. Did they post it yet? Um, they, I mean, people are already posting it. Four for twenty-four coming to Barnes and Noble bookstore at to. Damn, you could buy it online too, bro. It's gonna be everywhere. Texas A&M shit. It's gonna be crazy. It depends on what team you want to go. Where is Bronny gonna play next? Oh, I don't know, right? Why is Bronny leaving USC? Anybody know? Is he not? Was he not getting minutes? I wasn't too. I wasn't. <sighs> His coach got fired. Uh, I didn't know. He's going to go to Duke. Ohio. West Virginia. Where's he going to go? I don't know. Does he play that much? How much minute? I know he had a obviously a health scare. Obviously, yeah, but he can go. Obviously, he can go wherever he wants. He can go wherever he wants. But he's got to get minutes. Where's he going to get minutes? He's got to get minutes, man. He's got to play. I think he's going to... I, he might go to what? Go to BU or UMass? What? Average less than three points. He's going to go to Ohio State. Why is he going to go to Ohio State? I mean... Ohio State hasn't even been relevant in basketball in a minute. Duke would be wild. I don't think he gets minutes at Duke, bro. I don't think he gets minutes at Duke. They literally beat Purdue this year. They trash. He's not going to the NBA, right? He's not going to the NBA. He can't go to the NBA. Can we agree? We, can we agree there? He's going to another school. He's not going to NBA. Yeah, he can't go to... I don't think he's going to Duke, UConn. He's got to go to a smaller school in, in a way. But like, no offense though, USC was a small school. USC is not really a big basketball school. So if, 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 if he struggled, if... I don't know...
He's going to UCF. Liam, welcome as a loiter. What up, Liam? Duke's point guard is a senior. Bronny could slide right in. Bro, Duke just reloads, bro. They're, bro, Duke got a point guard as a senior. Yeah, they probably already got a McDonald's All American signed that's going to step right in. They just, dude, Duke just reloads. Duke, a well-oiled machine leak. Duke has four to five stars playing. Come, yeah, four or five star players coming in. Yeah. Ross, good morning. Talent-wise, Bronny's not that good in the NBA, but LeGM, can you can get him in the NBA? Yeah, Ross, why the hell Cooper Flag looks like your younger brother? I'm going to hit him up. I got to get him on the show. Duke got Cooper Flag coming in next year. Top five player, yeah. Top five player. He's the number one player, isn't he? He's the number one player, Gatorade Player of the Year. I could see Akron or Miami, Ohio. Damn, you want him to go that smaller of a school? I don't think he goes that small when he's going to go to Miami, of Ohio. That's, that'd be just embarrassing. That's embarrassing if he goes to that. He's got to stay... He's got to stay in this realm. He just has to transfer to a mid-major school. Those other power conferences ain't it for him. Damn. He's going to go to Maitland Technical College? What? Alabama State. Bro, y'all just goofy now. Auburn. West Virginia wouldn't be that bad. I don't know, man. He'd be fine. I mean, look at him. He's fine. Look at that big dunk. Ah. They went 13 and 17. See? So I don't know what you're talking about. I'm worried that because he couldn't play at USC. You just seen highlights, Ross? John Morant balled out at Dayton. Dayton is a big time school, buddy. Are you kidding me? Dayton is a big time basketball school. Dayton, uh, Creighton, Gonzaga, those are all big time schools, bro. Dayton, he didn't go to Dayton at Dayton, Murray State. What the hell is he talking about? Maybe he met Murray State. I was gonna say Xavier. Xavier is a big time as a good basketball school. <laughs> you guys, this is why we don't have sp sports talk. This is why we don't have sports talk because I just honestly believe some of you guys, and you guys don't even know what the hell you're talking about. Ross, John Morant balled out at Dayton. Here I am, like, oh yeah, Dayton's a good school. You went to freaking Murray State.
Not even close. Yeah, Seton Hall is good. Murray State. LeBron balled out at Dequies. Dequies? Yeah, LeBron, LeBron balled out at Dequies. Dequies. Davidson is a big basketball school, too. Davidson, where um, Curry went, that's a pretty big basketball school. Man, they, they, they probably suck now, but like, they're a big time basketball school. Uh, Bronny gonna go to Duke because his dad. Ross, who do you think is the MVP of the NBA this year? Probably shy. Should be shy. Uh, first of all, Dayton Dayton is not a big time basketball school. I only heard of him because of Curry. Curry didn't go to Dayton. He went to Davidson. Davidson's in North Carolina, and the, that's exactly. It's in Charlotte. Charlotte. It's right next to uh, the cat. The cat man. The cat man lives right next to it. Listen, I don't know. Is uh, the, I don't know if Bronny leaves Cali. It seems like he's all about the Cali LA lifestyle. That's why I'm like so shocked that he would want to leave USC. But maybe he's forced out or something. I don't know. Maybe he just he has to get out of there. But I I, I can't really see him being out of LA. He just seems like an LA guy with his whole FaZe clan stuff. You know? But I guess I'm wrong. UCLA is a big time basketball school, but I don't know if he plays at UCLA. San Diego State, Santa Barbara Community College. No, well, obviously he's got to go. He's gonna go somewhere else. He's gonna go out. But I'm just saying, it's kind of like USC isn't a state school. I know it's not a state school, but I'm just saying it's like. We're just saying, like, I can't, I don't know, I can't picture. Bronny's going to go to Colorado and play football for Coach Prime, Georgia State. All right, you guys are just pulling shit out of your ass. You guys ruined the segment. Now we're all over the fucking place. We're literally all over the place. I have a gut feeling that Bronny stays four years in college and will have a big evolution in his game. I think that I think he's the type of person that would definitely benefit from playing four years. But the problem is his dad's not going to wait. You know, how much pressure, you know, his dad, dude, LeBron's done. That. LeBron's coming down, dude. Like he's, he's going to be washed in a year. LeBron's got maybe one more year and he's washed. <laughs> he's gonna be dude i'm telling you one more year and he's washed you're gonna see a drastic drop off <laughs> gonna be washed all right, we'll see. He's already washed. Let him know. He's already washed. (laughs) 
He's got three more years. I seriously could see him going to a place like St. Mary's. St. Mary's. Goes from 25 points to 23 points. Wash. He's going to go from 25 points to 15 points. Being a, He's going to be on the bench. He's going he's gonna to be the sixth man. Listen, I don't... Listen, I'm not... I have no... A. Hey, at the end of the day, I have no problem whatsoever what's going on with Braun. He can stay in L.A. L.A. is not winning a chip anytime soon. So let him stay there. I'm perfectly fine because the GM is doing a fantastic job over there. That team is doing an unbelievable run. They're going to be one or do, one or done, maybe second round. Hey, good year. Same thing, run it back again. Again, do it. One and done. So I'm happy. They're going to have to sign him again. They're gonna pay, you're going to have to pay LeBron a, a boatload of money too. Isn't LeBron's contract coming up too? I'm 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 perfectly fine. LeBron, you're going to have to pay LeBron soon. Yeah, Celtics Celtics are washed. We're the fucking number 1 seed, chump. Number 1 seed. Ain't nobody right now touching us. We already, bro. Bro, have you seen the games? We're, we're out there looking like the Globe Trotters cuz the games mean nothing. Games mean nothing right now. Did you hear the coach? Coach is like, oh yeah, we're just messing around. We're putting uh, Pazingas on point guard to see if we can do... Dude, they're, they're treating the games like practice. They're treating the games like practice right now. The Hawks got a number? First of all, I mean, we, we dudes didn't even play. They didn't even take it serious. I'm just saying. What's the matter? Be here, Ross getting to stirring up the pot again. Stirring up the pot. I'm stirring it up. Ross can go to GNC. I know, Jason. What's Jason saying? Jason, I know he left your school, huh? Jason's all upset. Bad tacos and, le and he's leaving USC. You're on a terrible roll here, Jason. Ross, you're talking tough until you got to play Miami again. Please. Miami is honestly... You guys were saying the Knicks yesterday. Now it's Miami. Now it's my... First of all, the Knicks are in shambles too. The Knicks suck. Miami, honestly, ain't scaring nobody. Jimmy Butler is a shell of himself. It's, 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 it's Terry Rozier's show over there now. And I'm just saying, playoffs are totally different. Playoffs are totally different. Embiid is back. Uh, stop judging Miami in the regular season, Bob. You know how you buy this now. Miami is garbage. Then they're, they're, they're a shell. They're nowhere in here. Stop trying to bring up previous years. You're bringing up previous years. It's a new year. Magic might might end up in third place, bro. The mag it's gonna be Magic Celtics Eastern Conference Finals. Magic Celtics Eastern Conference Finals. Magic gonna Magic gonna take out the Knicks. Celtics gonna take out the Heat. Bucks are gonna just f shit themselves. Spolster's overrated. Dude, he's so overrated. Miami actually has a squad. No, what? Where? Who? Who? Miami actually has a squad. Who? Tyler Heroes hasn't even played, bro. Tyler Heroes been hurt all year.
Celtics implosion incoming? Sure. Sure. Celtics going to bounce out in the second round? Pfft. Okay. Rozier is hate heating up. It's Ross shaking in his boots. Bro, Rozier ain't scaring nobody. Ross, please stop making yourself look dumb. All right, listen. All I say is I, I take some hot takes. I spit some hot takes. Y'all clown me. And then when playoffs come around, I sit back and I watch and I laugh. Because all of it comes... All of it happens, and you watch it, and you're going to look like, damn, Ross was right. Shit, again. Ross was right again. That's how it always is. How it always is. I'm always hated on, and then I'm respected. But I'm telling you, Tatum lifting up that finals MVP, whoo! You, I'm telling you, you do not want to be on that stream. You do not want to be on that stream. When Tatum lifts that MVP finals after dropping a 40-piece. After dropping a 40-piece. All right. Boosta, appreciate it. Thank you, Boosta. Thank you for the re -up. Appreciate you. Just saying. Just like you thought that the Celtics were beating the Warriors. I mean, Curry went off. Curry hasn't been the same since. I mean, that was probably... Dude, Curry, I'm not going to lie. That was probably one of the craziest games I've ever seen. Curry, like, literally was shooting half court. Poole was hitting, like, half court threes. There was nothing you could do. There was nothing you could do. That was Curry just... Curry just took over. Yeah. <laughs> Cheap on the likes today, Ross? What do you mean? Y'all talk crazy, and he said, what? Y'all won't win another? What do you mean? Come get your shocks. But I do agree, Celtics should win it all. I mean, we'll see. Ross, how the hell y'all beat in Denver? It's going to be tough. It's going to be tough. Is it possible? Yeah. 1,000% it's possible. Um, but it's not going to be easy. I mean, that's gonna, that, I mean, every time they played Denver, it's been like, it goes down to the wire. That's gonna be it. If they, if they end up playing Celtics, Den Celtics Nuggets, like that shit's gonna, pff, that'd be a crazy finals. That's going, that's going seven. All right, Danny says thank you to the two Celtics. Oh, got Cook on the playoffs. They are weak. All right, we'll see this year. We will see this year. We will see. We'll see what happens. Pazingas is going to call Jokic daddy. Pazingas? Pazingas is tough. I mean, he doesn't, they play totally two different positions. Nobody can really, Jokic is like, you see that back and forth of Jokic and Wemby? It's like crazy yesterday. But, <sighs> Fear of God just dropped. You copping, Ross? <laughs> Hell no. Let that shit brick. Let that shit brick. Let that shit brick. Let that shit bit brick. Uh, he's a defensive liability, though. Who is? Pazingas? Yeah, I mean, he's a stretch. He's a stretch five. Who's like skin and bones. Celtics Clippers, please. I'm sorry, but Clippers, no. Absolutely no. 
Go, 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 go. Go pay you 250 for these shits. These things, send them to the outlets. Send them to the outlets. Send them to the outlets. The shock shoe is live if you want it. The triple black, all black. Shock shoe is live. Man, fog is crazy. Fog is expensive, man. I mean, this shoe right here, bro, still available in full sizes, is like way under retail now. Bro, like... Bro, it's a hundred bucks, man. 100, 160 bucks. How bad is that? 170 bucks. 166 dollars for these. Holy shit. This is a $250 shoe. A $250 shoe. The shocks are selling off fast. Shocks cooked. Shocks cooked. Shocks cooked. I told you these things were going to sell out. These things were actually pretty dope. The black colorways, I don't like it. But the this one, yeah, this one's not this one's nice. These ones are dope. These ones are actually pretty dope. Shocks are coming back, guys. absolutely cooked it just goes to show you though i think most of it was in um i think most of the sizes were in women's anyways men's probably were super light uh they should have been 175 dollars max bro he wanted to charge more money for those he said those things should have been like 500 dollars shoes Ain't nobody buying them, bro. Adidas, Adidas, unfortunately. Oh, shit, it sold out in small sizes. Maybe they're fly. Or maybe, I don't know. I don't know if there was like... Oh, they're flying out. They're selling. It's probably like no stock. It's the only way they can sell these. Oh, sold out. Adidas sold out. Adidas is sold out. The green, the black and green pairs are still very available. It's the white and cream, which is funny that that was the one that. I like the Fog Runners. They're the best, but they're $100 overpriced. Bro, they're not even, I don't know. I returned my pair. I'll be honest. I returned my pair. I, I returned my pair. Once I saw them, like, dude, I paid like two sixty something for it. Once I saw them for one seventy five, I sent them shits right back. I sent them shits right back. Sorry. W on the shocks, bro. Nice. I mean, I'll be honest, like, bro, I'm not paying that shit, bro. If they're going on sale, no, thank you. Here's your runners, full size available.
Ross, they say go half size up on New Balance 1000s. Okay. Two eighty for some pants. You guys don't like the clothing either. A hundred and forty dollars for this thing. A hundred and forty dollars for a performance tank that just says Adidas on it. Apple Pro Vision tanked. What about it? I mean, I don't think some of these clothing is that bad. It's just too expensive. The sweatpants look nice. The fleece pants look nice. Uh, I like the one model, but I'm not paying 250 Anybody buy these? See, 220 Nope. No one's buying these. God, they're in trouble, bro. They're in big trouble. They're in big trouble. And this just started. This just started. I just got a notification. Confirmed. Very God Athletics. Available now. Ross going to cop. It's going to get worse. It's going to get really bad. Unless they come up with something. I mean, these are just too expensive. I mean, I'll, I'll cop some of this stuff if it goes on sale. Right? We'll, we'll catch it on the clearance racks. We'll catch this shit on the clearance racks. I don't even think, like, let's be honest. I think, bro, the biggest issue is that it's too expensive. It's not trash. It's not trash. Like, some of this shit is dope. It's just too expensive. It's way too expensive. It's overpriced. It's like, it is what it is. If this is how much they want to charge, I'm sorry. I can't afford I'm not buying this. I'm good. I mean, if that's what, I'm not the, then I'm not the right client for this. I'm not the right client. You know, this is uh, priced way above. This is for the, the, the people that like, you know, it's a different audience. It's not for me. Even though these leggings look really nice. I think I would look good in those leggings. You know? Like, it's like, like the sweats, I mess with the sweats. The sweats look dope. These sweats, like all these sweats. I mean, I'm sure I could pull some of this stuff off. Like, I think this shit looks nice and comfy. But like, it's just, I'm, it's way too expensive, man. Choose rich. I just would rather spend my money on something else. You know what I mean? Right? I'd rather spend my money on something else. For that type of how expensive it is, like I like it, but I like I don't like it. Four hundred dollars, you know. Like I think the sweatpants are dope. I think these pants are really nice. These suede pants, like the suede pants, like some of the stuff I would wear. I think he like it. I think it's very well done, but the pricing is just too much. So it is what it is. It is what it is. Yeah. $200 for shorts, yeah. None of that is Florida attire for the next six months. I know, bro. I'm, out, I'm outside wearing my big banana thong. My big um, buns out, out, you know what I mean? I'm not wearing the shit, but like still. Ross, check show UWs when you get a chance. Nice! Gap with the huge W yesterday. 
bonus paid tw- you paid seven hundred dollars what'd you do mookie bets first plate appearance you're a psycho you're betting on first first plate appearance would you say a fielder's choice will settle as in play or if out is recorded would you bet on oh a triple that he would get a triple on his first plate appearance you're a psycho Absolutely, you're a psycho. Um, Ross, you buy a two hundred dollars shoe. How is two hundred dollars shorts a lot? I just know never stand that logic. Well, let's see, rich boy. I mean, even I will admit, bro, I have cut back a lot on two hundred dollars shoes. I mean. What's the last two hundred dollars shoe I bought? I mean, maybe my Kyrie's. The Drakes. I re- the Drakes. I didn't get them. They. I got my money back. The breads. The bread fours. Yeah, that was the last two hundred dollars shoe I got. Um, yeah, I mean, but I, I've cut back, I've cut back a lot, I've cut back a lot, and why do you, all you guys have cut back, I mean, show your W's has been very quiet, you know, I'd rather take that $200 and put it on a pile A. Ross, I saw you flexing a six-figure income on a YouTube short. You can get those suede pants. Uh Uh-oh. Yeah. With how many people that are in here today, bro, can can literally shows you. It literally shows you the testament of sneakers, bro. Okay? Take a look around at the restaurant today. This should tell you where sneakers is at and where the interest in sneakers as the number one live cop channel, okay, for sneakers, this should tell you where we're at right now in the game. Okay? Take a look around. So, like, this shit, no offense, is fucking cooked. And we're not, honestly, I hate to break... Like we're not even we're not even out of it yet, bro. Like th- we're not even in the worst days. The worst days are still ahead. Wait till the summertime. Wait till the summertime. The summertime is usually the worst. It's the worst. Uh, you know. You ever wear your Union Fours? Absolutely. <clears throat> yeah, but there's nothing good dropping. That's probably why. Bro, these fours would have went nuts. These fours would have went nuts. I mean, nothing good dropping? Bro, JD Sports, exclusive access for the fours? Bro, people would have went bananas over these. You know, people would have went bananas over these. It's, uh, they're yellow, but uh, bro, uh, how many trash colorways have we seen sell out all the time? Now everyone's trying to make excuses, but... How is everyone making excuses now, but when reality, like, bro, think of all the shit that sold out in the past. 
bro, they dude, the purple, the purple shit sold out. Y'all went crazy not too long ago for the purple people shits. Y'all literally went over the Grimace shoes. People went crazy over Grimace. This shoe is awful. The yellow Tom Sachs sold out. Yeah. But I'm just saying in general, like, there's been some awful questionable colorways that have come out that people have eaten up. Right? Again, you're looking in hindsight, but at the time, people ate them up, man. Yellow, ye pollens, people ate the pollens up, the taxis up. Those fours ain't awful. Yeah, and I'm saying these yellows are not awful, but you guys are saying these yellows are horrible. You're saying that these ones are horrible. What's your gamer tag? Uh, I have to check. I think it's Seagulls 47. I'll have to double check. Why, wow, you ready to play? We'll play at 11 o'clock. Going to play at 11? Yellow is worse. But you, I'm just saying, though, I mean, chats tripping, those fours are a nice colorway. They're not, like, maybe they're not for people, but they're not terrible, right? Is it, is it the worst we've seen? No. Like, maybe, you know, people are, I mean, people are just like, you know, oh, they, you know, they're not for me. It's, you know, yellow's not a vibe right now. And like, I understand that, but like, they're not the worst four I've seen. I'm trying to find out like a decent picture of them. I just think times have changed too though, man. I just think that like Jordan brand is slowly, slowly like just becoming like, I don't know. I think Jordan brand's losing it big time. I really do. I think we're in a period of a transition. And I think Jordan Brand is just kind of lost right now. I think they overpriced themselves out of the market. Especially when these New Balance 1000s come out. These New Balance 1000s come out, I think are going to... I I'm starting to believe I think these New Balance 1000s could pop off big time. If they're priced correctly, I think they could pop off. I mean, these Joe Fresh goods are going to go crazy. I mean, personally, I know I'm like on the fence, but these Joe Fresh goods are going to go nuts. These Joe Fresh goods are going to go crazy. And if this shoe actually kind of like hits, I think, I think this one's going to be somewhat, somewhat successful. One is JD exclusive access. In store was today. Ship to me is tomorrow. So, yeah, these Joe Fresh goods. Good luck with New Balance. Not going to get you. Yeah. So, I'm just saying, like, I, I think these are going to hit. I think these are going to hit. This is when these drop. I think EQL raffle next week. EQL raffle next week for these is the rumor. So, the EQL raffle. Jordan has nothing besides Travis. People only wear threes, fours, ones. After that, everything's a brick, and those are played out. What's next? I don't know. I don't know. I think uh, they're definitely in a rut right now. Um, I think the J Balvins will do very well for Jordan Brand. I saw a picture of the J Balvins. They look super, super nice, but like that's one and done. You know what I mean? That's just one hit. 
right? Like these look fucking nice. Gorgon, Gorgon, I am 1000% agreeing with you on these. These are better than the cream pair. These are fire. These are fire. This is a hit. This is a hit. These go stupid. They look really nice. The Amaminier 3s are better. Nah, these are way better. I don't we don't even know what the Amaminier 3s is. I'm not going off the mock-ups. The you talking about these ones? Bro, we've been I we've been uh catfished so many times on mock-ups. You talking about these? Yeah. I gotta I gotta actually see the shoe. They uh, actual I gotta actually see the shoe. Like this, I see it. No chance they're better than the white pair. I just think they're so much better because the colors pop more. I mean, the cream is just too subtle. I mean, this is definitely a vibe. As a white dude, I can't get down with all black sneakers. Bro, go outside, get some sun, bro. But we'll see. I'm a Manier is dropping a black pair of threes and a white pair of threes. Elliot has them on his channel. He actually has them. He actually has them. He has them before anybody else. Before before the whole world, he has them before everybody else. Where? Uh, uh, okay, nothing. All right, I'll let it be. Suede threes, Eminem, white dude wearing black hats at the show. They skyrocketed. That's what. <laughs> Buying hype sneakers from the store. Everybody was everybody reselling. Everybody's reselling their dunks. Telling you, uh, sway threes. You guys buying these? God, chat, no, please don't.
You guys buying the flower slides? God. Hold on. Shock drop. I'll be right back.
Oh. Woo! That feels better. My bad. My apologies. Oh. Whew. Sorry. Yeah. When your stomach starts churning, it's time to go. Sorry. That's not like me. I make sure it's all said and done before the show starts. But I don't know. That hit me like a ton of bricks. Hit me like a ton of bricks, man. Woof. Uh, did you post and show you? <laughs> um, all right. So you guys got the slides? What about the slides here? Yeah. Anybody getting the Wemby's? Anyone getting the Wemby's, bro? Wow, they really did them dirty. I mean, I wouldn't say they, they, they did them dirty. I mean, they can't really do much. Everyone doesn't like them. Nobody likes them. I mean, they can't do much because it's only been like a year. You know? So they only could do like a PE in a way. They can't. They, he's gonna. He's next in line. He's gonna get his own shoe. He's gonna get his own shoe. He's Wemby is getting his own shoe, without a fact. We're like that's one thousand percent. He's getting his own shoe. But I mean, I think it's it's fine. It's gonna hold people over. You know what I mean? Better than Booker's. Yeah, he was on fire yesterday. Almost quadruple double, dude. He was nasty. Yeah. He was um he was nasty yesterday. So I'm saying like they can't put out a new shoe. It takes a long time to design and like he probably won't get a shoe till like year 3. But I mean I guess with the whole theme of alien, I mean it's cool. If anybody if there's any Wemby fans out there. It's pretty dope. Nine blocks against Jokic yesterday. He killed me in fantasy. Did he? Jeez. I mean, he's balling out right now. Big man can't sell shoes. I don't think they really care. I don't think they care. But in like six, seven years, he's the face of the NBA. And they want him in Nikes. Just that's the reality. In six or seven years, he's the face of the NBA. Unless something changes. And I don't care. I don't think they care if he sells shoes or not. They just want him in shoes. A future Laker? God, here we go. Um, yeah, I don't see him in the league six, seven years. What? Now you just start having sneaker apps vote on possible silhouettes to design ideas. Pfft. Like you, you, you talking like, like sneakerheads know what they want, bro. Sneakerheads don't know shit. Sneakerheads don't know shit, dude. They think they want it, but then they really don't want it. They change their mind more than anybody. It's dumb for Nike not to use the sneakers app to decide. What's effing decides a player signing with Nike versus Jordan? Like, how do they split these people up? It's, I think, people... What, they're two separate entities. They pick and choose which one they want to join, I guess. I don't know. Maybe they have the option. I don't know. It's a great idea. It's a great question. It's a great question. 
uh, Nike did that Levan Vite two years ago and never bought the winning LeBrons out. What's happened? You see Embiid signed to Skechers? Yeah. Good for him. I mean, bro, a lot of these players, and this is why I say shy, bro. Shy needs to go small. Like, you guys clown this. You guys literally clown this. But why not be the face of Skechers basketball and get a shit ton of money than be the 10th man in line at Nike, right? Like, it just makes sense. It just makes sense. Get the bag somewhere else. Right? Him and, um, what's his face? From the Knicks. Why be, why be, you know, so all these guys are marketable in a way. I mean, that's good for Skechers. Skechers got a couple players. They're going to get more. Skechers is going to get a couple more players. It's crazy that how, like, everybody used to rock one brand. It used to be all Nike. And now it's, like, so diverse, bro. It's so diverse. Kai Sinan, Shai, Wemby, and Travis are all the new fresh faces of shoes this year and next year. Why'd you throw Kai in there? Why'd you just, th what? Why'd you slip Kai in? Kai isn't, what? Kai's, I feel like they don't even know what to do with Kai right now. Kai's just getting the bag, man. He's just pushing DNs right now. He's pushing DNs. Yeah, and Travis is not a fresh face. Travis, you guys will say, is past his prime on the sneaker game. Saw him in person that night, blown away. Who? Grab a guaranteed deal instead of waiting for something that might never happen? What do you mean? Um, Travis is at University of Texas tomorrow. Yeah, he is. Yep, University of Texas. Uh, tomorrow we have the Cactus Jack College, back to, back to college um, stuff. But... Shy needs to go somewhere. I think he'd be a great fit at Puma. I think he would be a great fit at Puma. But I don't know. Maybe he sticks with Converse. Maybe Converse will give him a bag. I know you guys are like, well, that's Nike. But still, they're separate branches. It's all different branches in, um, over there. But yeah, he could just stick with Converse. Be the face of Converse basketball. But they're going to dump, bring back, they're gonna have to dump the Brinks, Brink trucks out. Disagree with you on the Skechers deal? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's more diverse. It's great for basketball. But, like, yeah, Scoot Henderson debuts the new 2K. Scoot, honestly, I mean, it's great that Scoot is getting a, a deal, but, bro, was it, I think, Briss, was it, Briss, weren't you saying he's going to be top five? out of the draft he was gonna be a top five player i don't know if he's struggling i don't know he couldn't shoot at all yesterday he was awful yesterday which was great because i took his under 18 and a half points and i cashed i'll go, pff, thank you scoot scoot makes me money He's back from G League. Yeah. I mean, he's 20. He's only 20. He's been in the G League partly. 
Yeah. They were saying Scoot's better than Paulo. Ain't no way. Paulo is a beast, man. Yeah, I don't know. The shoes ain't that bad, though. Man, Puma's got some dope basketball shoes, though. They're kind of wild and crazy, and I like how Puma just doesn't give a shit. They're just super... Like, those look actually look crazy on court. Like, they don't care, bro. Like, they just go super colorful. As far as casual wear, I'm all set. But as far as their basketball line, you know, I have to say their basketball line is actually pretty decent. You know? They just embrace the craziness, which I think works for them. The Cheetos pair. Remember the Cheetos pair? Like, embrace it, bro. Just embrace it. Yeah. Yeah, you're not, yeah, you're not, I don't think Puma, I mean, I don't think Puma's different style, I think maybe, I don't know if I would want that for casual, casual like that, but like, they cool? I mean, they tried to get, I think they tried to get Kai on Puma. I mean, remember when Melo sent him a shit ton? Yeah, LaMelo is definitely, LaMelo definitely is selling shoes like that. I mean, basketball's having a run, bro. Basketball's having a run, dude. I think right now, that's the hottest shoes right now in the game is basketball. I don't think anybody would question that. Basketball shoes are the hottest thing right now. Like, is anybody going to question? I don't know. Like, there's just, I don't see anybody touching. Fear of God selling out. Jerry's buying them all, that's why. Jerry's buying them all. Uh, Jerry's like, we can't let these sit. Buy them up, buy them up. Yeah. Columbia's got leaked. Bum, 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 bum. What happened to Big Baller Brand? Oh, here you go. Your first image. Here's your Columbia's. Here you go. I wonder how 11s are going to do this year. I wonder how 11s are going to do this year. I don't know. I wonder how 11s are going to do. To me, the drop-off in 11s... 11s every year I felt like after cool gray 11s it's just been a slow drop off in interest in 11s year after year after year after year I could be wrong but overall that's just how I feel I feel like the 11 interest has just kind of like kept going slowly dying it, you know I don't know maybe because it's just like the people that have, that have the 11s got them all already. I don't know. 
that level 11s. I think 11s are not it anymore after cool grays. My Concord 2018 pair still on ice. I don't think people like patent leather anymore. Bro, like things change, but there's definitely, there's definitely, uh, I'd say, there's people out there that love 11s, love it, like really, really love 11s. But I mean, from my perspective, it definitely feels like the interest in Levens have died down year after year after year. Even with a million pairs, it still sells out every year. It takes a while, but yeah. The last one, I mean, they restocked them like a million times, but yeah. I mean, just curious where where has the where has the last eleven been sitting at? Cool grays, bro. Cool grays were like insane. Cool grays were insane. I mean, the DMP. I thought the DMP was gonna be. It's below retail, bro. <laughs> They're under retail. They're fucking under retail, man. <laughs> They're under retail. Because people bought them up. People bought them up, dude. Thinking they were going to resell. Oh, these are women's. What the hell? Oh. Cherries. You can hold on it for two years and make 60 bucks. Uh, year after year, JB is release, releasing a lot of shoes in the holiday season. Yeah, that's where they kind of, they fucking crunch it all in there. It's terrible business practices. But they try to shove everything and release everything in the last two months. So it's like, obviously, everything gets spread out. Your money gets spread out so thin. It's not really that great, but like, yeah. Low 11s are better. I mean, honestly, don't you guys got, like, I wouldn't be shocked if the low 11s do better this year. A few more years, a lot of those shoes will be up in resale. Yeah, just keep holding. holding just hold all your shit for, like, 10 years. They'll all go up. Bro, who the hell is keeping these types of shoes DS for like f five years, bro? Mm. Again, you guys are like, hold it for five years. Uh, uh, hold it, yeah, hold it for five years, but then you got to realize, like, who the hell is looking for, who's going to be looking for gratitudes in 2028? <laughs> who's going to wake up in 2028 like, damn, I need a pair of gratitude 11s. Let me buy them on stock X. You know, another, like, everybody wants the newest thing, man. Not a lot of people go back. You know? Like, that's the thing. Like, who the hell... Your customer base is probably so small. Like, yeah, okay, the shoes are worth $300, $400, but who the hell... It's going to take you months to sell it. So, see, I could see these doing well. 
Hey man, I was looking for Volt Golds a while ago before StockX told me they were fake. Volt Golds? What's the Volt Golds? Hello, what used to be the case before online resale? What? What used to be the case? I have like 50 pairs of various yeah, shoes for a couple of years. Most of them are flat out down or down a bit. Waste of time. <laughs> bro, if you were holding shoes like a year, like a couple years ago and you still have them now, bro, you lost money. You lost a shit ton of money. All the, all the value of all your high-end shoes, most of them went down. So you ended up losing money holding. But they ain't making the last dance too. Yeah, I was agree. I back up your point. No, I'm just saying, yeah. Not my Travis Fragment lows. I mean, there's some exceptions. But your Travis Fragment highs, your Travis Fragment highs actually lost, you lost like $2,000. You're like... People cop in older shoes because they were hard to get and had value now online resale losing value. I mean, we pulled up the uh, the unions. The unions are down. The unions are down like four or five hundred dollars. The union low. The union ones. The union ones are way down. So that's what I'm saying. Sometimes you hold for too long. It's like, especially the high end shit. Uh, exactly. SB four is way overpriced. SB fours is like a three fifty shoe tops. I mean, we'll see. I mean, that's a tough one though, because SB fours, it's the first ever Jordan four SB. So maybe, but it all depends. I think what's what's keeping that shoe high is that they haven't released any more SB fours. If they release. If they release more SB fours, it could do it could do num it could do numbers. It could go up or it could go down. But because it's the one single SB four, it's gonna stay where it is. It's gonna keep climbing a little bit. You know. So Travis Scott, we popping up in a few schools. He's going to LSU. He's going to LSU, Texas, and then USC. Damn, he's gonna be all over the place. The OG color was way higher. In some scenarios, you're right. Some scenarios, you're right. But if like if people like the other SB4 more, you never know. If they do a black cap, if they do a black cat SB4, it's way better. Uh, we'll see. Trophy room one lows are down too. I mean, they kept going down. Um, yeah, because we got a shit ton of pairs just got dumped into the market from the resellers. Um, they, how low are they? Last time I checked, they were like 450. Ah, uh, they're still right around, they're 500. They're still there. Oh, they're women's though. What the hell? Yeah, they're like 450-ish. 
I think that's it, though. I think this is where the I think this is where the bottom is, though. You know what I mean? If you guys are new here, just join, man. Oh my god, bro, really? We've been going for two hours. We only have 140 likes. You guys slacking today? We should have 200 likes. 100 likes per hour. Hit that like button if you haven't done so just yet, man. Thanks for hanging out with me on this Wednesday. Chill Wednesday. We're we're linking up with crew in about like a few minutes, so. Hit that like button, run it up, man. If they drop to like 300, I'll get the lows. Yeah, I don't think they're going 300, bro. I think this is as low as it gets. Everyone has their pair. I don't know. I, I Unless there's a restock, I think this is it. This is the bottom. This is the bottom. You know? Like, I think all the sneakers app orders have shipped... Everyone's got them in hand. Resellers are going to hold them. So, I mean, there's what, what, what would make it drop? Holy shit. Breaking news, Adam Scheffner. Bills are finalizing a trade to send four-time Pro Bowl wide receiver Stephon Diggs to the Houston Texans for draft pick compensation. Wow. Wow. There he is. You can tell he was done. He was done with Buffalo. He was done with Buffalo. Calling Houston to the Super Bowl? Relax. 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 Just, I mean, it doesn't move the needle that well. I mean, damn, though, Bills lost both their wide receivers. They lost Diggs, and they lost what's-his-face, the tall guy that stretches the field. Didn't they? Oh, did they, they? I think they lost him, right? Yeah, Gabe Davis. Yeah. Gabe Davis is gone. I mean, the Bills are down bad. I mean, they're going to have to get, I mean, at the end of the day, they're going to have to get some, I mean, they'll be fine. Bills will be fine. They're going to have to draft some wide receivers, though. For, I mean, their first pick is a draft. First pick in the draft for them is going to be a wide receiver. This wide receiver draft is actually pretty good, too. Um, but, I mean, what do you... I mean, that's why I say, dude... The, the, dude, the window for these teams... You, you got a small window, bro. You got you to gotta, you gotta get over the hump. You got to get over the hump. You only have a few years, and that's it. Bills had a nice run. They have a few years. Now they got to rebuild. Now they got to build it back up again, and they'll be back. But the window for these guys, the window for these teams, you only got a few years. Got to win while your QB is on a rookie contract. I mean, they'll give it a shot now. I mean, hopefully it pays off for the Texans. But um, tape will be out year two. Year two is always tougher than year one. So, you know, the tape is already out. Defense, I mean, last year you could surprise people. Nobody took, everyone took you lightly as a Texans. Yeah, you're the Texans. No one's going to take you lightly next year. Or this, this upcoming season.
All it took was a second in next year's draft. Damn, they wanted him gone, huh? They wanted him gone. Six, seven, eight, 50 months. LFG, Tank Dell, Diggs, plus Nico. H down, baby. And I just hit my hit on my CS2 pick. Sup, Ross? What up, man? Congratulations, bro. Texan division is sus. They can easily make it. Yeah, they got the compensation. Uh, yeah, I mean, they can make the playoffs, but I'm just saying, like, you know what I mean? Like, it's going to be a little bit tougher. It's not going to be as easy. Uh, you know, it's not going to be as easy as it was last year. People are, are not going to take you lightly. They know you're coming. And uh, they should be a solid team. They should be a playoff team again. It's going to be tough. You still got to get past the Chiefs. Still got to get past uh, Patty Mahomes. Bro, digs to Houston is huge. It moves their needle a lot. Dude, some of you guys get so raw rod up over names. Is it a nice little piece? Yes. But bro, it it relax. You guys, oh, they got Stefan Diggs, put him in the Super Bowl. They're winning it. Relax. The game isn't won on paper. The game isn't won on paper. We'll see. Is it a nice piece? Absolutely. We'll see what happens. We'll see if it gels and it works. Calling this a good wide receiver draft class, but crapping on the NBA draft? Are you serious, bro? Bro. Are you serious? I mean, top five players in the M in the NFL draft are wide receivers. Marv Marvin Harrison Jr. and the dude from LSU. Top five players. I mean, I got the big board right now. Marvin Harrison Jr. Okay, could be one. Could be the best player in the draft. Okay, Malik Neighbors, beast. Uh, you have the Washington wide receiver. You have the other wide receiver from LSU. This this draft class is insane. Look at the big the big boards got top fifty. They got ten people in the top fifty. Just still think of the twenty five months. Hey Ross, I know we don't always agree on everything, but thanks for all you do. Definitely make people's day better. Keep up the good work. Thank you, bro. Appreciate you. I think Diggs is going to shine on the Texans low key. He's got to catch the ball, buddy. He dropped some ball. He dropped some balls in that playoff game. I mean, you can say all you want about uh, Josh Allen. He had a couple catchable passes. Uh. Bro, I never said Houston is winning the Super Bowl, but you did. But you said Diggs Houston doesn't move the needle. I mean, I mean, it's not gonna hurt, right? It's not gonna hurt. We'll see how it goes. But I didn't watch. I didn't watch the Texans game and say, "Damn, they need another wide receiver," right? I, in the playoffs. You know, I don't, when I watch the Texans game, what, they just kind of like, Needle isn't championship or bust. They won one first round last year and possible second round. Yeah, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens in a sorry running game. There you go. We'll see what happens this year. Listen, Diggs is a, a Diggs is a solid wide receiver. He's a solid wide receiver. Top. I mean, is he top ten? 
Is Diggs top 10? Diggs can be top 10. I, I, if you want to put Diggs top 10, Diggs is top 10. Let's see. CD Lamb, CD Lamb, Tyreek Hill, AJ Brown. Uh, maybe Justin Jefferson, yeah. Devontae Adams, Jamar Chase. Well, looking at statistics, statistics wise, he's number seven statistically for yards. He's number seven with a hundred receptions. So statistically, He's top 10. Statistically, he's top 10 last year. What does that matter? Does that matter? We'll see. Um, is he better? Okay, let's go. Let's go. Is he better? Is he better than Keenan Allen? Is he better than Keenan Allen? Is he better than Keenan Allen? Yes or no? Because I kind of put him somewhat similar. I mean, Keenan Allen just had his, one of his best years. Is he, I think they're kind of like similar. Is he better than St. Brown? No. He's not better than St. Brown. He's not better than St. Brown. I mean, St. Brown is much younger, too. He's not better than... He, you think he's better than St. Brown right now? Right now, you think he's better than St. Brown? And he's better than Tyreek Hill? Stop it. Yeah, but you're going off of y'all forgot who Diggs is. I'm not saying, dude, you, you got to go off of now. Now. In the now. You got to go off of now. Not what he was five years ago. Fine, is he better? Then here you go, Briss. Is he better than Michael Pittman? Is he, is he, I'm not, nobody's saying he's washed. Bro, St. Brown and, uh, St. Brown and Keenan Allen both had, what, St. Brown had 1,500 yards received, uh, 1,500, 1,500 yards, and, uh, Keenan Allen had 1,200. Is he better than Michael Pittman? Yes, easily. Michael Pittman had uh, 1,100 yards Last year, 1,100 yards last year. Okay. All right, we'll put some big names on there. Is he better than Jamar Chase? Is he better than Jamar Chase? Man said, is he better than Michael Pittman? Bro, I'm going off of statistics. Statistically, look at this. This is the list of the best wide receivers. Statistically, of last year. It, I mean, bro, CeeDee Lamb, 1,700 yards, 12 touchdowns. Tyree Kill, 1,700 yards, 13 touchdowns. St. Brown, 1,500 yards, 10 touchdowns. 
Michael Pittman, 1,100 yards, four touchdowns. Keenan Allen, 1,200 yards, seven touchdowns. Stephon Diggs, 1,100 yards, eight touchdowns. Devontae Adams, uh, 1,100 yards, eight touchdowns. Look over the last... Yeah, but see, football, it's not like... Football is different, though. I think you guys get caught up in that shit. That's why That's why a lot of the... Dude, you guys could never be a GM. Good thing you guys could... Good thing you guys could never, never be a GM in the NFL. You would overpay everybody. You don't pay off... You don't go off their past. Football is all about future. It's not about past. It's all about future. You guys could never be a GM. You guys could be overpaying everybody. Oh, you got he had he had a he had 10 15 touchdowns 3 years ago, 4 years ago. Okay? Football is all what you done for me lately. And what can you do for me in the future? After the first contract, you pay for upside. Yeah. It's different. Football is totally different. It's not like basketball. Basketball, basketball, you don't have to worry about it because I think your basketball, you get you get better in your 30s, right? You get better in your 30s in a way in basketball, like your late 20s, early, you know, early 30s. You get, you're like, that's like your prime is totally different. In football, thirty in football is uh, you know, you're oh, you're 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 not over the hump, but you can see it upon the horizon. Twenty eight through thirty three is prime in NBA. Yeah, what would you say prime prime for NFL? Prime for NFL is like twenty five. It's got to be right. It's got to be the like 25, 26, depending on the position, of course. Not QB. QB, obviously, is totally different. QB is totally different. QB is totally different. Because of less contact. Yeah, it's totally different, totally different sports, 100%. Totally different. Prime for running back it's in 25, yeah. Joe Biden says, I'm still in my prime, but 25, but NFL 25, yeah. Like right around that. Receivers like 24 through 28. It's totally different. It's a different sport, like you said. But I'm listen, I'm let's go back to what we are arguing. Is this a great move for the Houston Texans? Absolutely. For a second round pick, you take it all day. Great move. Do I do I think this automatically puts them as like contenders of winning the Super Bowl? No, I don't think so. But it does make their offense a little bit more explosive. It's gonna make them, you know, more. It's gonna they make defensive coordinators give them a little bit more of a headache because who do you cover? You know, you to you go do to Nico through the middle, or you gotta worry about Stefan on the outside, right? It's like. They have two different now options. And football is always different too. It's tough because obviously health is huge. You know, health, you get these dudes get banged up, man. So it's like really tough. I mean, so yeah. And we'll see. We'll see how Stroud is. Stroud is a good quarterback. Easily, you know, probably the best rookie quarterback. Way better than Bryce Young. Bryce Young looks to be a bust. But... Year two is a lot different, man. Ask Mac Jones. Ask ask Mac Jones about year two. Year two is it's 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 not easy for quarterbacks. It's one of the hardest years. Year two. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. Definitely exciting times because you know what the hell is happening for Houston. Houston, you know, no offense. Last time I remembered you had an excitement. Y'all wore your varsity jackets while you came to New England. And Tom Brady sent you your ass home packing, okay? So is it a little bit? It's a little bit exciting for Houston. You compare Matt Jones to 
Bro, Mac Jones, first of all, Mac Jones had a great year one. Mac Jones had a solid year one. That's all I'm saying. Year one doesn't automatically transition to year two. It doesn't just automatically, oh, you have one good year, you're just going to be a Hall of Famer. That's the whole point. All right, then put just go ahead, put Stroud in the NFL. Put Stroud, go ahead, go ahead, put him in the Hall of Fame. Put Stroud, put Stroud in the Hall of Fame. You guys already got him in. Put him in. Year one, put him in the Hall of Fame. Go ahead. Raffy. Hey, Raffy. Says Ross only wearing Patriots gear when the. Hey, hey, Raff. Who's won a Super Bowl? Uh, who's won the last Super Bowl? Was it the 49ers or the Cowboys? Who's won who's hey, who's who's won their Super Bowl closer? Let me hey who, who hey, I can't remember. Can you refresh my memory? Can you refresh my memory? Who won hey, who won? Who's got the last Super Bowl win? The Cowboys or the 49ers? Listen, it don't matter how many hey, you can get there all you want, but you gotta win the big game. You got you gotta win the big game. It doesn't matter. Listen, I don't care. Oh, I've been there. Oh, at least they've been there. So what? You took the girl. You took the girl to the da- to the dance, and she went home with someone else. What does that matter? You still that's an L, buddy. It doesn't matter. You took the hottest girl to prom, and guess what? She went home with your buddy. Still an L. You gotta finish. You gotta finish. You gotta finish. You got to finish. I thought you said football was about future, about the past. I mean, it's a little smack talk. It's not a big deal. At the end of the day, I still roll up my Niners gear, win or lose. I know. I know you're a Niners fan. Uh... Jones was destined to fail. All Bama QBs. Listen, I. Yeah, but you can say that. But now, whoa, whoa, whoa! All Bama. Oh, look at that! Now all Bama QBs suck. Hurts has been a bust. This man's already got Hurts as a bust. Damn, you putting Hurts as a bust already, huh? Hurts is a bust. You don't. You know, no more tush push for you. Hurts. He says Hurts is a bust. Wow. All Bama QBs suck. Uh, this draft class is gonna be nice. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be interesting. A little little movement. Hurts played for Oklahoma last. Bama let him walk. Yeah, he got replaced by Tua, and Tua just became the highest paid NFL player. What three hundred million? Tua just Tua just got the bag. Good luck, Miami. Good luck. I got to catch a Miami game this year. Um, yeah, Tua got the bag. They had to pay him. They have no choice. You're, you know, what are you going to do? You ever what? You guys watch the hard knocks? Oh, my God. Tua is like interesting. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Look at, oh, look, here we go. This is what I need, Patriots fans. Let's go. I like this guy. Dolphins paying two of five hundred billion. Jets are paying Mike Williams, Tyron Smith, and Aaron Rodgers for two games. The Bills are self-destructing. My Pats will be selecting Drake May soon. Let's go. Where's the highlight tape? Absolutely. Let's go, baby. I love it. The Patriots are going to suck anyways next year. I don't know why, but yeah. Are we getting Drake May? We might get Drake May. We'll see. 
It's going to be uh, that third pick, baby. That third pick's going to be interesting. You know it's going to be dry. We're covering NFL offseason. I mean, it's Wednesday. What do you want me to do? Do you want me to just make shoes magically appear? What do you want me to do? Let me just make shoes pull out and pull them out of thin air for you. <laughs> Patriots fans, your time has passed. I w- hey, honestly, you're probably right. But hey, it was we had a fucking great run, bro. We had a great run, a legendary run. I don't believe Ross is a Pats fan. He just likes him because he's there and they were winning. He's one of those that Bill goes to the Cowboys. I'll be the biggest Cowboys fans. Hell yeah. And Bill we trust. And Bill we trust. I mean, you you forget, man. I grew up with Tom Brady and Bill Belichick. That's all I knew. That's all I knew. So, of course, I still want him to succeed. This new, this new, this new, uh, I don't know. We, this new team hasn't won me over yet. I don't know, I don't know what they're doing. I don't know what they're doing. Uh, yeah, my nan is a cook if we don't want a chip the next two years. I don't know. Ayuk, Ayuk wants out. He says, bring the bag. He wants the bag. You might have to go hand him your, uh, you might have to hand him the money, Raph, unless he's leaving too. Uh, Ross has become a Magic fan solely. Dude, hey, I want to... Dude, don't sleep on the Magic, man. Listen, I can have two teams, man. I can have two teams. Why can't I have two teams? I'm part I'm part Boston and Florida. Ross, pull up the tape on Jaden Daniels. I'm, I don't know if Jaden... Jaden Daniels might not be him. I don't know. We'll see how Jaden Daniels. I I would be nervous. I'm nervous about ta- about that. Oh, get out of here! Uh, you want the Magic to go far and host the Celtics here, so you can go. Absolutely. Why not, bro? I haven't seen the Celtics play this year. I usually see them every year. I haven't. I haven't seen them. Um, but we'll see. Hey Ross, good morning. Watching you from uh, the my Dallas chair every morning. Oh, appreciate it, my Dallas. Ed, appreciate you, man. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm in the championship in my NBA fantasy league. I might lose that one too. Can't catch a break. Uh oh. You're doing better than that, though. Last you gave up like midway. You gave up midway through the NFL fantasy. I don't blame you. The hell is this? More fives coming? Oh yeah, yeah. I love how it's like. Air Jordan 5 releasing Pat McAfee. This is bullshit. What's he all fired up about? Pat McAfee. The new look Houston Texans offense. QB, CJ Stroud. Running back Joe Mixon. Wide receiver Stephon Diggs. Wide receiver Nico Collins. Wide receiver Tank Dell. And tight end Dalton Schultz. I like Schultz. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Because the Colts? Okay. I like Dalton Schultz. I don't know. Dallas should never let that guy walk, but I get it. I like Dalton Schultz with the big, that weird ass neck thing around him. I like Schultz. Schultz is a pretty solid tight end. Not too flashy. Catches the ball, though. All ex Cowboys. Yeah. We had Tank Dell and Eco. I hope Anthony Richardson has a better year this season. He's gonna play. He's got to play. Anthony Richardson's got to play. They don't even know what they have. He's got to play. He was out all last year. What is the neck thing? It's like uh whatever the um concussion thing, so you don't snap your neck back, or whatever neck roll, the neck roll. I think it's for a concussion though. It's like a, it looks like a, I don't know, a necklace. 
He says he might quit football. Who? Lions will win it this year. I... I don't... I don't know what the... I feel... I, I'm nervous for the Lions, man. I'm nervous for the Lions. I think that the Lions could have just had a one good year, and that's it. I don't know. I would like to see the Lions. That city is amazing. You know, they, they, they went crazy for their team, but... So I'll look at the Texans. Texans are enjoying it. Um, I'm just nervous for the Lions. My Cowboys down the drain made zero F freaking moves. Bro, you guys don't need to make that many moves. You guys don't need to make that many moves. You guys had the number one offense in the NFL. You had the number one. How about you guys just live up to the expectation in the playoffs? How about just not shitting yourselves when it's time to play in big games? How about that? You guys have a great regular season. But then when you go to the playoffs, y'all are a totally different team. They need a running back. You can draft a running back. You can draft a running back. That's an easy plug. Draft a young running back who can handle, who can not fumble. Just don't fumble the football. Just run forward. He'd be fine. You'd be fine. So it's like, you. I mean, you guys don't. What are you guys missing? I mean, I guess with the run, uh, you know, you're gonna need some. I think you just gotta need a good draft. You guys need a a good draft. You guys need a good draft. But the biggest problem isn't like you guys lack talent. You know, you guys, you, you didn't even have Diggs last year. Diggs was hurt the whole year, too. Remember that. You're the best defensive lineman in the NFL. Uh, Michael Parsons is still top, top three. Should be number one, but top three, best pass rusher in the game. Dak is always going to put up yards. You guys just got to play good in the, you're the number one wide receiver in the NFL. C.D. Lamb's number one. You guys just got to play in the playoffs. You guys got to play good. Can't shit yourself. I think Cowboys need a running back and a solid two. I mean, running back, I think you can get in the draft. You can get a veteran running back if you want, uh, probably. I mean, think about it, dude. There's still tons of time. Listen, season, offseason's not done. I mean, yeah, you didn't spend any money on free agency. I don't think you need a Derrick Henry. You don't need a Derrick Henry. I'm sorry. The Ravens is not going to... Please. You don't, need a you don't need a Saquon Barkley. You need a young running back. Okay. And then get a veteran running back. Someone's going to get cut. Always happens, right? Always happens that people are going to get cut. You can scoop someone up. You can get, you know, someone's going to get cut. It always happens. Some big, time, some big time name always gets cut. Anyone that's get cut is washed. It's a, I mean, I think you'd be fine. You never know. Zeke is not the answer. Do not bring back Zeke. No offense. Do not bring back Zeke. Zeke is not it. We're talking about a win now. I know. You'll be fine. You can have Najee Harris. Najee Harris. People think Najee Harris, Najee Harris is going to have a big year, but you say that every year. Uh, the problem is this year's draft class is thin at the running back position. 
Yeah, but there's always sleepers. You got to do some digging. You got to do some digging, man. Find someone from freaking, I don't know. Find the running back from some Division II school from North Dakota State University Community College. Get your, get, uh, do your homework. Find someone from some, uh, I don't know. From some mid-level school. Whatever, Miami, Ohio or some shit. You can get running backs, bro. I'm telling you. Pacheco was a seven-rounder. It could be done. No, I, dude. Absolutely can be done. Bro, he was the he was the thirtieth pick in round seven, and he was he was one of the best players in the Super Bowl. So it could be done. That's why I, you know, football is different. Football draft, it's not like NBA. MB, NBA is tough. Football though, football it's like. You can find hidden gems in the third, fourth, fifth, sixth, and they turn into be all pro, uh, you know, 10 year vets, Hall of Famers everywhere, right? You don't need to have the first pick. Even like, dude, there's like a, no offense, it feels like there's a curse to have the f- top five pick. It's always like a curse. That's a curse because Bryce Young, not looking too good right now, right? They might have missed that. And if you miss, you're screwed. But the QB position has been in shambles too. The QB position is like, you know, Patriots, what? I mean, the 49ers. 49ers, right, Raph? 49ers, QB, for instance. You you guys wrecked, absolutely wrecked. What's his face? Trey Lance. Trey Lance. Trey Lance was a top five pick, wasn't he? Wrecked him. Third pick of the draft. Third pick of the draft. Didn't even play. Didn't even play, man. So nothing is given in the NFL. Yeah. Because he's going to rot in his bench. Dude, have, no offense, have you seen his highlights in practice? He's overthrowing dudes by 10 yards. Bro, he's throwing the ball to the sideline and it's hitting cheerleaders. Like, I, he's a, he's, he was a mess. He was an absolute mess. And and that should say a lot when you're out of um, Shanahan's system, which is Shanahan's system is a QB friendly system. I mean, is Purdy anybody special? No, Shanahan's making Purdy look like a Hall of Famer. What position would Raffy play? <laughs> He'd be a good, I don't know, a, a, a nose guard. Let me hit him up. Let me see what he's doing. Uh, uh. Someone said a water boy. Damn, they put you a disrespect, man. They said a water boy. My chat is super disrespect. I'm heading to the gym. Nice. Oh, yeah, what is it, early? It's still early over there, too. Alright. 
What is he talking about? Send me an invite. I'm just going to call him on Discord. What the hell is he talking about? Oh, he's calling me. Yo. Yo. I can't hear you. You ready? Can you hear me? I can hear you. Okay. All right. Yeah, I'm ready. All right, man. Let me see. What's your um? What's your hold game on, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Actually, I'm not ready. I haven't. I don't have it on. You don't have it. On? I don't have it. I think I, I got it on already. Let me see. We're just. We'll just keep. Hey, we'll just keep you. We'll just keep Discord call. We'll do. We'll just yeah, keep it as Discord. Call. Yeah, let's just keep the Discord call. That's better that way because I don't know if my computer. My computer probably can't. Yeah, I don't want to wear no headphones and shit. Yeah, I ain't wearing no headphones. All right, what's, what are we doing? We doing our what? All right, man. What you want to do? Let's see. Um. Uh, you want to do? Let's go. You want to do gifted? You can't gift on uh, vertical. Let's do, we can do it tomorrow. We can do it tomorrow. All right. I'll do it tomorrow. We can do it tomorrow. Don't worry about it. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We playing Madden, gang. They said we playing Madden. Yeah, we playing Madden. Let me... Um, let me. Which view do you guys like better? Do you guys like this oh, one better with the game at the top? Or do you shit. guys like this one better with the game at the bottom? Let me know in the chat. Shit. I might need assistance on this. Hold on. Turn this I might down. have an issue here. No. Oh, here we go. Never mind. I'm all set. Oh, the volume loud as hell. I gotta figure out. <laughs> all right, it's a little bit delay. I gotta figure out how to um. Uh. I don't even know how to turn the volume down on here, but it's cool. Uh, game on the bottom. All right, bad. Let's put the game on the bottom. I'm like a bird. Let me fly away. Nelly for a touch. No, bye. Yo, who's right, you? Bet. Hey, hold on. Hold on. Let me see. Wait, do you know who you play? How are we picking teams? You pick whatever? Okay. How do I go to um, accessibility settings? settings? Let me go here. I gotta go. Wait. Volume control. We're supposed to get dusted? Stop. Where's Crew? Crew's playing on his channel. He's not going to be... Bet. That's much better. Okay, bet. All right. Let me send him a game. Uh, get this W. Game at the top. No chat. Scrolling. Don't matter anyways. I'm on desktop. Uh, game on the top. We, we have to see you win. All right. Game on the top. All right. What the hell just happened? All right. Let me send him... What's your what's your gamer tag, Roscoe? I said random. Random. I gotta play Pats versus the Bears. I know that's what we said. <laughs> Yo, is he still in the call? Did he get out the call? I used to. Why can't I hear you? Can you hear me now? I can see the green thing lighting up, but I can't hear you anymore. That's, I, yeah. Hello? Nope. I see it lighting up. Yo! But I can't hear you. Let me call you back. All right. Yo. 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 What'd you do to your settings? Not working. It was just working. He can't hear me now. Click random three times. Hold on. I don't think my online is working right now. All right. Just when it was working, it had to go press something. I know. Please reset my password. All right, hold on. I got to do my password. I don't know what's up with him. He's all screwed up. Can you guys hear the game?
the hell is this? Yo. Yo. I can't hear you in the app and I can't hear you on desktop. What the hell? I don't, that's, I don't think that's, I don't think it's me because I just, I was just listening to you and then you just like cut off. Let me try I, this. Let me try to hit you up on Instagram call. All right. It was me, bro. <laughs> it was you. Yeah, it was me, bro. What'd you do? I turned I turned my speakers down on accident. God, I knew it was you. Yeah, it was me, bro. It's always me, man. You gotta know that. All right. Ugh. Hold on. It says right. that I gotta hold on. I gotta sign in. Okay. It says that I can't go online yet because I'm not on my EA account. Oh yeah, sign in. Where do I sign in on my EA account on this game? It should have popped up at the bottom. Extras, maybe? Controller, redeem code, settings? Oh, uh, I'm already signed in, so I didn't have to sign in. Um, yeah, I know. I just had to reset my password. Just hit the... If you hit the... Is it the... you on Xbox, right? I'm on PlayStation. Uh, on PlayStation? Oh, yeah. Damn, oh, hold know. on. Sign in to EA R2. There we go. Dumb. You got it? And then tell me what your um. It says reset password. Welcome back to login credentials have expired, but you need to do is reset your password. I already fucking resetted it. I already reset it. What the fuck? I just reset it. See now you got to reset it again. Nah, that makes no sense. I gotta hold on. Let me restart my um. Let me just restart it. Port. We chilling. We chilling. Hey, look, man. Who's gonna be my 7,000 sub, man? I need two more freaking subs, man. Two more. Who's gonna be 7,000 today? Huh. Rami, don't call me an amateur, man. Listen. It's super low. All right, we'll figure it out. On who's in? Can no, people are saying can they hear my chat. Can chat, can you hear chat? Chat, can they hear can they hear you, crew? They should be able to hear crew. It should be able to hear me. Yeah. I got my I got my games turned down super low because I just didn't want it to be super loud on y'all, man. I didn't want it to like double. You're a rookie, Ross. Someone from my chat's calling me a rookie. We can hear you. Okay, bet. Um, I just gotta I'm trying to fix my. Ah, it's about to be live. Let me get this shit working. Yeah, you good. Take your time. All right, let's see. Bum, bum. Madden 5. Console storage. What the fuck is this? To conflict in your save data? Save select data. Okay. <laughs> they said don't let Roscoe use the Giants. Uh-oh. Is that his team? I don't know what I'm going to use. Uh, make Ross use the Patriots. Hey, sports, it's in the game. It should be at the bottom right. This is about to be live, gang. This is about to be live. Your EAID, HHSB crew on YT. That's yeah, it funny. keeps telling me to fucking welcome back. Your login credentials have expired. Damn, this makes you no to, sense. You to, did you... Do it in like uh did you go to like EA on the on your desktop and maybe see if you could do it there? What's up, ghost? This makes no sense. You can't see what your EA ID is. That way I can maybe just see if I can send you. Force close the app launcher. That's what they're telling you to do. Force close the app launcher. 
and reopen it. It says password recovery. I would, I don't need a password recovery. I just reset it. So yeah, that's what they're saying. They're saying force close it thing. Like go close it out and then go back in maybe. I don't know. Attention, in order to access online features. Amateur hour, hold on. <laughs> Go to EA Link PlayStation account. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to do it on the... Um... Yeah, what the hell? Uh, uh Every time you say that, I want to be like, it's macaroni time. If y'all know what I'm talking about, y'all know what I'm talking about. Boomers trying to work technology. Chill. <laughs> y'all, wow, we not boomers. I think he had it. I think he I, he, he reset his password. Hold on, I got a link. No, no, it's not, it's not linked. Oh, it's not linked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ross is on PS5. That's why he's having all these issues, because, you know, Xbox is way simpler. Kind of like the iPhone thing, too, you know? Uh, what's my fucking... Hold on. Give me one second. I'm gonna. Get, I'm fixing this Good. right now. Take your time. What difficulty level am I playing on? Rookie? Never. Never. Um, I saw you said you downloaded Matt. Madden. I just deleted it so I can fit something else, but can always get it back. Oh yeah, I seen that, Carney. I, I accepted your friend's uh, your friend request. Yo, anybody want to add me? Just add me, bro. Add me. That way, y'all can send me a request and we can get games in. I forgot what email address is my PSN. It's been so while. Alex, ill. Say it with your um, throat. That's that's disgusting. Why would you say that? What is the password? I think it's this one. Nope, that's not it. Hold on. Good morning. Got to link it by allowing EA to log in through PS5. He tripping. Took me one minute yesterday. So what? Do you, what happened? What do you got to do? Crew officially. Damn, just saw what? Maradona jersey. Yeah, bro. He said, "Say it with the throat." He's going full Diddy today. I don't know what's up with him. No one ever goes full Diddy. Current gen consoles. Yeah. I'm on um Series X. Crew, what's your gamer tag? I can't see it. Oh, right here. You can't see it in the corner? In the right corner, top right corner? HHSB crew on YT. I should change that, but. I got it. You got it? Yeah, it should work now. What's your EAID? Hold on. Give me one second. Okay. Uh, I. Freaking so stupid. <laughs> Bet I got it. There you go. Because it's like an old email address and shit. Yeah, that you don't have access to? Well, I just haven't used it in a while. Oh, yeah. But at least you got access to it because that's the worst. Yeah. You ever heard of Mongolian throat singing? Yo. It's like an old Hotmail account that I fucking used way back in the day. <laughs> that Hotmail? Damn. Yeah. EA is Timmy6969. Stop. Let's see. It still doesn't work. What? what what's, the, what's the error is giving you? Reset my password. Did you force close it and go back in? I'm forcing it right now. Okay. 
about to get, get clipped hard as hell for all this music, though. <laughs> this dude forgot password. NDK, what up? What? Man, hit that like button, man. It says I am banned. You're banned? Maybe create a new EA account with a new email. It says linked accounts found. Your account can't be linked because you all, your PlayStation Network account blank already linked to an EA account for bd at disabled.ea.com. What does that even mean? You're banned? I have no idea. He's banned. Am I banned? Oh, did I get hacked? What up, Aiden? I don't know, bro. Maybe try to create a new account with a different email since that's an old one. Just use a different email? Okay. Yeah, use a different email. So Bad gonna... boy for life. What the? I've never seen that before. Create a new PSN? I'm not creating a new PSN. You know what they're saying, bro. They're saying you ducking me. That's do I have to create a new PSN? You probably do. He was hacking in the other EA games. He probably was, man. He'd be out here killing y'all in that Fortnite. Telling How do I, man. Bro, I can't create a new PSN account because... Why not? Oh, wait, because then your game won't be on there. Yeah, or right? like my whole online... I pay whatever. But um, then you can't use it anyway if it's banned. The fuck? Old email accounts get deactivated. That's probably it. Contact EA. He ain't got time for that, though, if we're trying to play now. New EA account. New EA account, not PSN. This That's is what they're saying. Make a, new, make a new EA account, not a PSN account. If his PSN is linked, he is screwed unless he creates a new account. Oh no! I'm gonna be screwed. Yeah, create a new. Try to create a new EA account. Yeah, but it... and then that would be the EA account that you signed into on the game. Yeah, but it's saying. Hold on. Why am I banned everywhere? <laughs> I don't know, bro. Uh, they said go on EA, create a new account, and then link PSN to that. Hold on. As long as I'm waiting, you I could go and cook up some eggs and bacon, uh, make some biscuits, come down, we could have breakfast, do a breakfast Madden stream, even though it's kind of late. It's all, all right. fucking send code, send this code, send that code. Yeah. EA's whack. I don't know. I dude, I don't use. Oh my god. They're probably gonna need to contact support, but if, if it's just the EA account, it shouldn't be though. Give me one second. Yeah. Chat. Bro, straight to toe, that's the meal right there, bro. Said I'm making uh, chorizo con huevos y queso. And some cheese, eggs, and uh, and chorizo. Fire. Some flour, get the, not flour, the corn tortillas, a little hot sauce. Blah, blah, blah. What up, fam? Y'all mess with sour cream, bro? I'm not a sour cream. Dude. I don't put sour cream on nothing, fam. I'm not like sour cream. I don't, I, I just can't. You know, yogurt, disgusting. Y'all y'all mess with that? I can't, bro. I, I said that because typically that's what they put. They put like uh, chihuahua cheese. 
they throw some chihuahua cheese on there and some uh, and some sour cream. But I'd be like, nah, I'm good on all that. Uh, bottom is prime. You hacking? No, nah, man. I'm trying to play. Uh, we're trying to play some Madden right now. I got my homie on the other oh. end. We're just trying to go ahead and get him uh, get him set up so we can um so we can play a couple games real quick. Um, chorizo and an omelet with some cheddar go crazy though. It does. You mess with yogurt? Nah, the smell of yogurt makes me like literally want to throw up. I just subscribed with Prime. Thank you, thank you for subbing with Prime. What's up, man? Appreciate you. How do you where now? Where the fuck I go for to link it? All right, so now how do you link it? How do you link the PSN to the new EA account? My guys? account settings. Resume player control, payments, order history, privacy. Security, Thought he said he was banned. Connections. Here we go. I think it was his other account. Crema over sour cream. Do you want some chicken? Uh, no, nah, I'm good right now though. <laughs> no, nah, I'm good on the chicken. It's kind of early for the chicken. Um, your account can't be linked because your PlayStation Network account is already linked to your EA account, banned, disabled. EA account can only be linked. So my account, my my PSN account is disabled. What? On EA. Wait, it says your EA account was linked to one that's banned. So can you remove an account? Can you remove the old account? Uh, what the fuck does that even mean? It's pouring like, I don't even know. If you reset your password too many times, your account will get timed out. It's not even that. It's just when I go to connections and I uh, go to PSN and I hit link and I go back and it says, your accounts can't be linked because your network, okay, I'll show you. This is what it says, chat. Like, what is this? Linked account found. Your accounts can't be linked because your PlayStation Network account already linked to your EA account or that email. An EA account can only be linked to one PlayStation. We might have to pick Network. this up tomorrow. We we'll might, dude. Yeah. Sign out of we your might. PSN. Yeah, try to sign out of it, and then if it doesn't work, we'll we'll pick it up. What is signing out of my PSN gonna do? If you sign out, you've already well. You, I think you have to you you have to remove the connected account. So how do you get into your PSN to remove the EA account that you don't want to use? Am I just going to have to create a new PSN account? That's saying his PSN is banned by EA. Damn. Just Ross is ducking? No, please. There's no, <laughs> what am I ducking about? Please, I ain't scared. Uh, you are scared, though. I mean, two things can be true. He's not ducking, but he's still scared. Change your email address? Okay. Let me change my email address. Maybe that's it. If I change my email address. Yeah, if he had an Xbox, bro, it would be this would be cooked already. We already be in the fourth quarter. I have an Xbox, but I'm not using it. People saying contact EA, you have guys ever tried to get a hold of someone from EA? Good luck. Same with Microsoft. I know. That's why I'm saying I might have to log in PSN and remove EA connection. That's what I said. Yeah, log in to PSN, remove the EA connection, and then you can add the other one probably. What the hell? We just remove the connection. Where the hell do you go to remove the connection? That sounds like a PlayStation thing. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Oh, just go in, remove the connection. Like, what? <laughs> yeah. Told you, PSN gets locked to an EA account. Because they, they get hacked all the time. Oh, that's crazy. I'm crazy at Madden. Blah, blah, blah. Crazy at Madden? Diagnostic Live. Just make a new PSN real quick. Bro, the PSN, do I... But I lose... Do I, I probably will lose my... Um... No, you can just have two. 
My PlayStation right? Plus? My PS Plus? Will I lose my PS Plus? Diagnostic Live? <laughs> yeah, that's hilarious, bro. I love that. Joel? <laughs> we are trying to figure this out. I might have to just nuke my PSN account. Yeah, Start bro, fresh. that's what it's looking like. Yo, for man, Chris, that's right. Never happens on Xbox. Go JMK. You got to stand together, man. Change your email on your PlayStation account. All right. Can't remove EA account from PSN without EA advisor. Yeah, you probably have, you probably got to make a whole new PSN. I probably I have think to make. Either, either way, it's probably lost without contacting EA. You can't have you can't have two though, right? Create a new PSN account. Should I just fucking nuke it? I might. I'll do. I'll do. I'll do this tonight. We'll have to scrap it. We'll pick this up tomorrow. You got you free tomorrow? Yeah. Yeah, we play yeah we'll, we'll run this back tomorrow. I thought Xbox I mean I be, thought I could sign in. I never have issues like this. I have to nuke my PSN, listen, man. PSN account. This is he, he knew this was gonna happen. This is just him ducking me like usual. Yeah, yeah, I've been yeah, calling yeah. him out for over a year. I'm hanging up on you. See ya. We finally get here, and now his PSN don't work. Don't that sound sketchy? See ya. Hanging up on his ass. Uh, just keep one PSN for everything else. Yeah, I'm, um, well, I, I mean, I, I got everything. We're good to go. I'll nuke it. I'll redo it. I got time this afternoon, but we'll put, we'll pick this up tomorrow. Yeah, we'll get it going. And then I'll, we'll, we'll be able to play. We could play 2k and shit. Ross trying to get practice tonight. I'll be, shh, I got time tonight too. I'll be back live at three o'clock. That's going to be doing it for me today. Um, I'll be back live. You have to reset your Fortnite also? What? That fucking... That's gonna, all going to suck. I have to... I have to reset my, my Fortnite? No. Bro, you can use my account. I got 2K Madden. Don't nuke your PSN. You'll lose everything you own. That's what I'm saying. I don't want to nuke my PS. I don't want to nuke it. It's just because I. it's probably inactive. So, you know what I mean? All right. We'll figure it out, though. Let me get this fixed. We'll be back running tomorrow. Tomorrow, what do we have? We could just start. We'll play earlier. We'll play earlier tomorrow. We'll play earlier. That's why you just change your email and your account. We'll try that, but I don't want to have everyone waiting and it doesn't work and it's just IT support the whole time. But I appreciate you guys for tuning in. I will see you guys later. Um, you might have to hit up support. Okay. We'll see. Um, I'm going to sign in and manage it and see what's up. Account settings and stuff. I, I have it all right here. I'm going to look into it. But all right, guys, before you add, I'll hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new and I'll catch you guys later. I'll see you guys later. Peace, everybody.